Good afternoon, guys. So, I just, it's actually, what day is today? September 6th? It is September, it is Sunday, September 6th. Oh, she wants to, she wants, she's saying she wants that. She wants that as in the camera. But anyways, it is Sunday, September 6th. And I just wanted to do an intro to this vlog because just wanted to let you know, I know these vlogs are late. These are, these vlogs, I'm sorry, these vlogs are like from a month ago. But we have a lot going on in our lives right now, which is PCSing. We are in the process, as you can see, of moving. We are starting to pack up some stuff. So, yeah, I'm gonna get, as of this point right now, anything that we have recorded prior to today, I'm hoping to get up before our household gets get, gets picked up, which is September 22nd. And then anything we vlog after today will just be in a vlog um, of our journey of PCSing. And that will be up after we've settled in at Washington. So, or in Washington, I should say. Settled in in Washington. I don't know, I can't speak English anymore, guys. But yeah, that's what's going on, so yeah. Enjoy these next couple vlogs. Who's bright? What's up, guys? So, um, what sucks? I guess that's better. Okay, so it is Monday night now. Um, nothing much has happened today, but we did get some... I guess some um, sad or unfortunate news. So, um, Enzo's doctor came in here and said that his bilirubin level is really high for his age, which is he's barely it's not even 24 hours yet. But his bilirubin bilirubin level is is the um, level of what a three a three day old baby should be. So it's really high for him. So um, he told us that Enzo's just gonna end up um, being at the being in the hospital for another five to, five days to a week, five to seven days. But Ruth is getting discharged tomorrow, so we're gonna end up leaving Enzo here in NICU or PED so that he can get the the lights and all the stuff he needs to get his bilirubin level down done. And um, yes, but we'll be visiting him every day. And um, yeah, it's gonna suck because we really wanted to be able to take him home. But right now we can't do that. Um, we want him to be healthy when he comes home. So yeah, we're gonna probably Ruth as long as nothing changes with Ruth. Then she's getting discharged tomorrow. We're going home tomorrow. But again, Enzo will be staying here for almost probably a week, which is about the same time we did for Jay. It was a little bit more frustrating with Jay because it was our first time kind of dealing with it. With Enzo, it's a little more understandable, and we know the staff here since this is where we had Jay. So we're more comfortable with leaving, having to leave Enzo here. Then it's just easier. Yeah. Because versus us staying here and getting stuck here and yeah. not being able to see one of our children. Yeah. At least the other way, we would still get to see both of them. Yeah. We, we they, kind of like with Jay, they gave us the option of discharging Ruth but letting us stay here with Enzo. But then downside of that is like Ruth said, we can't see Jay. We can't leave. We can't leave. We have, we're stuck here. And um, we can't go see Jay. And so, with us going home, we'll leave Enzo in really good care here. And then we'll sell it, be able to see him and Jay. What's well, not even recording? I'm gonna punch you. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but baby boy is back there in his light. And his mask is coming off, so you gotta go adjust. Oh, is it? Oh. His mask is always coming off. And here's baby boy. 
So he's supposed to have this mask on to protect his eyes from the lights. But this thing just does not want to stay on. But guys, update so far in the last hour old he is. He's been really chill. Like, Jalen, we had such a hard time with her in this thing because she did not want to be in this thing. She was crying all the time. This dude, we put him in it and he's asleep. Like, I think he'd rather be in this than out here, honestly. Because once we set him in here, he's knocked out. So, I don't know. Knock on wood that he doesn't change his temperament when we get home and all of a sudden he won't go to sleep or something, but. Ooh, baby. Hi. Where's the baby? Where's the baby? Good evening, guys. So, I don't know if you can hear me, but um, actually, hold on. Let's let's wait a moment here. Are you done? No. Yeah. Okay. So, let me just bring you up to speed on this last week. So today is now Monday, July 27th. We have not vlogged since, honestly, I don't know, but you guys will see from this last clip. But anyways, baby boy is still in the hospital. Enzo is, is still in the hospital. They're going to recheck his bilirubin levels tomorrow morning. So hopefully we get to bring him home soon because baby boy is already a week old. And... I just want to bring him home. We just want to bring him home. Just want him and Janelyn to meet and, you know, just feel complete now. But that's pretty much where we're at. Um, I've been going every day to the hospital for a few hours a day to go visit him. Um, I just went there a little bit earlier. And now... Yeah. <laughs> Now we are out here in the garage, as you guys can probably tell. We are about to wash the car. Huh, ain't that right, little girl? We're gonna wash the car? And our garage is a mess, like, oh my god. But yep, Jane Ellen's about to help her daddy wash the car. That's what all that loud noise was. It was the pressure washer. And yeah, and that is pretty much the only reason why I'm picking up the camera right now is because I want to catch Janeline washing the car with her daddy. You gonna help daddy wash the car? No? Come on, let's go wash the car with daddy. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Wednesday the 29th and well my mom is currently at the hospital with Enzo we 
got them to make an exception and let my mom go up and see him. So while she's there for a couple hours, we are here at the park having a picnic. Yeah, can you say picnic? <laughs> Is she even on the camera? Can you say picnic? <laughs> Good afternoon! Guys, so today is Thursday, July 30th. And our baby boy finally gets to come home! minutes ago that his levels are good and the doctor is discharging him today so that is where we're headed right now and I we we are just so happy I had like tears of joy do you have anything to say <laughs> not saying anything I'm just happy that guys I'm so happy it's been long long how many days has it been already He's yeah. 11 days old today. I'm just excited for so, him to meet Jay for him and just, just, Yes. So we are going, we're on the way to the hospital to go pick him up. And probably this next clip is him and Jane Allen meeting. So excited for that. Yay! I'm so excited. <laughs> Your brother, say hi. Yeah. Cool, cool, baby. Put him down. It's your brother. Yeah. He's, he's hungry. It's your brother. Say hi. Okay, hey, relax. Welcome home, handsome boy. Say hi, Enzo. Say hi. Who's that? Your brother? <laughs> Is I love you, Enzo. Say wah wah. Sit down there. I'll sit down with you. Go sit down. Go sit down over here. You hold the baby, okay? You have to be careful. Okay. Look, the baby old enough. Look, Jay, look. Look at me. Look at mama. Smile to mama. Yeah, hold the baby. Hold the baby. Smile at mama. Look, take picture. Smile. Hey, look. 